Y'all heard of this one? Alright, King of Fighters 95. What the... When was this release? Where's my, where's my cheat sheet? July 25th, 1995. NGH number 084. I should probably kill that music, huh? Wait, how many megs? 250 megs! Actually, less megs than Fatal Fury 3, if you can believe that. Despite having more characters, I guess because they're they're smaller. <laughs> so KOF ninety four for SNK it was like it was a bigger hit than they they thought it would be. Like the initial like internal testing for SNK, they they didn't think ninety four was going to be a a big game. I guess because they weren't happy with with how much money it was making on location tests. Even though it was it was being played like pretty much the entire time, but it wasn't bringing in enough money because uh, turns out matches take longer when they're three out of five rounds instead of two out of three, and so they they attempt to address that in this game, which is uh, uh, maybe not the best way to implement it. Just jack up the damage on everything. But oops, that's the wrong button. Uh, where's... I'm lost. There we go. But, of course, the, uh, the big deal is, of course, Team Edit System. Yes. The original KOF 94, you could not switch your characters. If you wanted to play Kim Kafwan, you had to, uh... Oh, I put it in the wrong thing, huh? <laughs> Developers SNK, yeah. <laughs> There we go. Yeah, if you wanted to play Kim Kafwan, you had to play two other losers. Team Edit was like the, the big thing everybody wanted. And of course SNK uh, SNK listened. They kinda they kinda doomed themselves by putting the uh, the year at the end of the title. They now gotta put these out on a on a yearly basis. Which probably led to a lot of crunch. For '95, though, they didn't have to change too much because they already had a uh, they already had a strong base in '94. They brought back most of the characters, like 21 out of the 24 characters, and only had to make a, a few new ones. Uh, we got another manual. Let's look at the manual. This one isn't as funny as the, the Fatal Fury 3 manual, but I figure we should uh, we should take a look. Kyo has uh, has bad breath and has to has to cover up. Oops. I know it's an it's an iconic Shinkiro art. Oops, where's my? Uh, there we go. Note to our users, and knock out a gratitude for your purchase of the King of Fires 95. Before jumping into battle, please read through, the, read through this exciting user's manual to best understand all the workings and excitement. During gameplay, be sure to keep this manual by your side for pure battle fun. Pure battle fun. Alright, this is all the stuff that was in the, the previous menu, the previous game. There's some, some weird art where they, they misspelled some character names. <laughs> <laughs> Jidern, Shikensu, Shin Genzai. All rules will follow the procedure of last year's tournament by teams of your own making. If you still have not learned your lesson, previous combatants are welcome to join. See you there, suckers! Your pal, the mysterious R. Oh yeah, Billy Kane with a C again. They still can't get it right. Whoever was like translating these manuals didn't uh didn't know Kane was with a with a K. B and C button combination. The dysfunction. That was on the uh, the insert. <laughs> I like four other characters. Defeated characters are represented with an X mark. Keep your eye on strength and power gauges. Beginning the battle. This is all the all the CD stuff menu. 
You can play in single mode if you don't want to play uh, three on three, which was also an option for arcade operators to do, but uh, I've never seen an arcade that actually like said it that way. Select the order of arenas your characters will fight in. All right. The attack deflector. You got the shot of Atina Neen King on the cooch. So there's also, yeah, that's one of the new things in this game. A and B was dodge in 94. They actually added a uh, the avoid attack, the dodge attack. If you push a button while you're dodging, you can do an attack during the dodge and cancel that into a special move. Because I guess they, they felt that dodging was was kind of bad defensively. Because if you uh, if you faked out the opponent and made them think you were going to do something, they would just dodge and... When you dodge, you can get grabbed, and there's no there's no throw text in this game. So C and D for the knockdown attack. There's there's new attack animations for jumping CDs. In '94, they were it was the same animation as like a jumping D, but it just had a it would just knock them down instantly. Use the flames of power by holding A, B, and C, and yeah, they changed the uh, the taunt move to B and C. In 94, it was just pressing C when you were at full screen, which was kind of inconsistent. Super Battle Blows. When your strength gauge begins to flash red, you see super special attacks. Oh yeah, Guard Cancel. That's a new thing. When the power gauge is at maximum, uh, they don't explain it very well, but you can actually cancel out of guard by doing a, any special move. Any special move. If you're fast enough, you can just Instantly cancel into a special move, and that's a a very strong tactic. Yeah, the guard piss. Tag team attacks. When you're not silly, move the joystick left and right and repeatedly press buttons to quickly recover your consciousness. This was definitely translated by the, the same guy who did the Fatal 3 3 manual, huh? Yeah, guard cancel is like an alpha counter, except there's no uh there's no like punishment. There's no like a meter loss for using it. Oh yeah, Kyo's grabbing some ass, huh? Three and three battles. First member of each team against a battle. It out in a one-round match. Winner of the match increases his or her power slightly based on win and time bonuses. By defeating the third opponent, you win. Remember, you little battling maniacs, you. Your strategy holds an important key, so... It holds an important key, too. So use that noggin of yours for more than headbutts. <laughs> Good lord. You little battling maniacs, you. Oh man, there's some Iori titty right here. 1995, Kyo and Iori meet to battle it out. There's some there's some weird art in this manual. But they're giving some lore about Iori since they knew he was going to... Uh, as Kyo's rival, he was going to be a big deal. And then, I, I guess here's just a picture of Atina's hair. She's camera shy, I guess. Oh yeah, he's got those those Sato shoulders, huh? Wait, wait, what's this? Behind the scenes, the dreaded Yagami clan manipulated the power holders of time, buffeting all good souls with winds of chaos? I hate chaos. Alright, whatever. I don't I don't play KOF for the lore. Oh also here's some here's some tiny billy armpit if if you're into that. Uh, stage guidebook. Yeah, those are those are the stages, all right. Can barely tell what they are. And whoop, we got a <laughs> we have some extra extra room in the manual. Here's uh here's Kyo striking a pose. Oh yeah, they got these little inter. Introductions again. You're no more than a smoldering fr flame, Yagami. Feel what Ariel blast, blast of Hades is. Hey, all you fight groupies, just watch my moves. And Goro just says, Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. The dark thrust, the fireball. It's called Dokugami. Oh, wait, that was 96. The new New Wave Smash. Yeah, they actually list the new moves. That weren't in 94. 
Sorry, everyone. The prize money is mine. A girl as pretty and tough as I am just has to win. Just pack it up and go home if you don't want to get hurt. Yeah, as you can see, there's a... They've definitely filled out the uh, the moveless for everybody a little better in this game. Like, it felt like everybody in 94, like, needed a... Needed a little more sauce, needed another move or two. <laughs> Eat this, Kyo. The flames of revenge from the Yagami clan. My sworn enemies of Kyo, Kugan, Karate. The day of fate is at hand. <laughs> Billy. Terry, this pulls for you. <laughs> God damn it. Billy Kane again. Billy with a C. They still can't get it right. They can never get it right. Yeah, AG hates uh, uh, Rio, Robert, and Takuma. He was in Art of Fighting, too. King of Fighters will sign me up and call me winner. Andy, what again? This time I walk away victorious. Oh, Sha! The genius Joe Higashi is about to twirl like a typhoon. The Holden Heel Herder? I think they meant Golden Heel Herder. Oh, yeah, Andy's got that, that Rekka attack. Rising Tackles! I love the Rising Tackles. Screw upper. All right, that will be victorious. They don't call me the Invincible Dragon for nothing. The King of Kyokugan Karate is about to clean up. Grr! My Kyokugan Karate cannot lose. Robert Galcia! Yeah, Galcia. They got it right up here. And they got it wrong right there. Man, they couldn't even, like, capitalize the, the Kensu and Chi Kensu. No one's gonna take my place as a superstar fighting babe. Atina, just sit back and watch my stuff. I'm coming home a winner, honey! Damn. I mean, you never, you never get to see Chin's wife, do you? Anyway. Uh, Jidern. If you want to walk away alive, you'll have to win. And there's the Akari boys. The Garling attack? Not the Gatling attack, but the Garling attack? Man, I keep seeing new typos for these moves. Storm Blinger? Final Blinger? I got that bling bling, son. Fuck yeah. Oh yeah, Jidern's really broken in this game, isn't he? <laughs> everybody, everybody doing the, the taint pose. Hey everyone, follow me in the battle. I'm really getting tired of that Kim Goody Two Shoes guy. Give me a break, Kim. Let me sharpen my nails first. Uh, the flying monkey slice. Those moves seem to check out. Oh wait, the sp 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 spinning iron ball. You're right. A or C repeatedly. <laughs> Who is the mysterious organizer of the King of Fighters? Just what is the identity of the mysterious R? And what enigmatic personage waits at the end of the line? The solution to all these questions rests in your hands. Yeah, like like it's gonna be a different R from from ninety four. Oh, hey, Ralph. But yeah, thanks again to uh, to Rage Quitter eighty seven for for putting these scans up on the Internet Archive. It's good to see these uh, these scans get preserved. Anyway, KOF 95. Oh, boy. Again, this is going to be a game where we have a lot of shit to talk about. A lot of stuff to show. <laughs> the R is for Ralph. The R is for Team Rocket. SNK presents. It's kind of quiet. There are no victims. Er, teams! Oopsies! that mysterious figure.
Okay, I have no idea who I'm gonna play. I think we might do an edit team. I have save states, right? I don't know what those save states are from. Only KOF on the Neo Geo to say the title of the game? That's not true. 97 does it. King of Fighters, 97. Story moves towards Final Destiny. Getting ahead of ourselves. Oh yeah, shout out to them finally or not finally, but making it so you can actually beat the default high score in this game without being without having to play like a bunch of versus matches. Like they didn't really change the scoring system much. And the default high score in 94 was 560,000, which is ridiculous. we're gonna play. Do I have my start button mapped? I do. Oh, we'll show the bosses later, I guess. No, no. Power up, psych. So the, the cursor defaults to no. <laughs> so, always remember to plus, press left first. Let's play... Uh, Let's go top tier. Let's play Kyo, Jidern, and and Mai. Actually, I don't think Mai's top tier, but she's pretty good. Yeah, you only have 15 seconds to find uh, to find three characters out of 24. Same thing with 96. So we still got stage intros and all that stuff. So right off the bat, you can tell, like, yeah, damage is pretty high in this game. And this game is going to, uh... Going to have the usual SNK problem of, uh... The CPU just beating the shit out of you and... Doing more damage with their attacks on higher stages. <laughs> yeah, why does that top shelf go so high? On the plus side, one thing they did, they did tone down the dizzies a little bit. Like, that would have been a Dizzy in 94. So it's a little harder to Dizzy people, but... Some characters can still do it. So yeah, you have a... Uh, dodge attack! Everybody's dodge attack is, is bufferable. Or is it easy to kill? Damn. Want to do the super move. I wonder if I can get the glitch. Oh, I got hit? That doesn't count. I gotta not get hit. I think sometimes Hydra can still get a dizzy really fast. Oh, I ripped her close. Sometimes just like combos ending in fireballs will will dizzy sometimes. Bozo. Oh shit, it's the stage. It's the stage. There's the boy. go! <laughs> I had to make him an emote, he's too good. Everybody loves that guy. I want to do some guard cancels. Come on. Oh. <laughs> Terry doesn't want to hit me. Oh god. Shit. Damn it. <laughs> Let's try and do the Stormbringer. Oh, 
Wow, the late cancel. Oh, there goes Terry's hat. Off to find a new home. The arranged version of this of this stage, so fucking good. We'll look at the CD version very briefly after after we play through this, of course. They actually did a, a new remix of this in, in KOF 15. It was like an unlock. You had to like get a certain like team com or certain like versus combination on the on one stage, I think. Although the new version is maybe a little too chill. God, the damage. Unfortunately, there's no character-specific win quote, so you don't have you don't have my talking shit to Andy. Unfortunately, am I going to PRG? I'll probably be there for a day. Maybe not the whole weekend. Wow, she just called Andy a peasant. All right, let's see if I can do the kill for it. Shit, that's not it. Shit, what was the... <laughs> How do you do it again? Whoa, auto mod, what the fuck? Is that a slur I'm not aware of? Weird. <laughs> I almost have the, the combo. Shit, I have to remember how to do that. So Kyo's pretty good in this game. <laughs> they gave him that uh, that new double kick that launches. He's also got one of the uh, one of the best dodge attacks in the game. Got so much range. And combos beautifully into, uh... Wow, what the fuck, auto mod? When did it, uh, when did it become a, a crime to say the word pedal on, uh, on Twitch? People gonna have to update their auto mods. I don't even have, like, auto mod turned on. The new team has won four matches. Uh, Vice, that was actually three matches. New team, interesting. Let's watch. Of course, we didn't know her name was Vice yet. Ah, it's the stage that uh, that doesn't show up right on stream if you're not watching at 60 frames per second. Oh, it's the rivalry, Kyo versus Yori. Oh, stop using sweep. Get him down. He's almost at max. God, that's just safe. Oh, it. Damn, that was a punish. <laughs> Yeah, that's uh, SNK's way of doing transparencies. Just draw the pixels one frame on, one frame off. Boy, just wait till Samurai Showdown 4. What a fucking mess that was. Uh, computers... <laughs> computers being a pedal pusher. I might have to continue already. Can't say that on Twitch. Bam. Wow, he just does the whole string. Okay, I'll take that. 
Oh no, he's good! That was my Dino impression. He's good! Actually, Yori's like third Rekka isn't. It's not all that bad. Oops! Oh yeah, she's got a DP. What was that crouch walk? I'm just gonna keep doing our DP. This poll's for you, Terry! Mai's gonna pull off the reverse OCB. AG's really good in this game, too. He's got some fucked up combos. Computer's not gonna do. Air throw! My turn to abuse air throw. Hold up. <laughs> Just keep doing it. Oh god. No! Wow, what, a, what an answer. Alright, let's play another team. And Ninja Style's Invincible, and I'm not too bad either. Uh, who do I want to play? Kensu's pretty good. She Kensu's pretty good. Maybe I can land the... Uh, Takuma death combo. And, uh... Hold on. <laughs> I, have to, I have to pause. I'm running out of time. I almost want to, uh... Ah, fuck. Let's play Asuna. The new China team. Actually, China team's a good a good pick because, like, Chin Super... is insane. I really want to land the, uh, the Takuma Dizzy combo, though. That was two hits, and I already lost half my life. That's not the Dizzy combo. It's that, but then you juggle with the, uh... Is it backwards fireball? Come on, I think it's backwards fireball. No, Saishu and Rugal are boss codes. Spoilers. I want to land that combo just once. I think that's it. Dizzy. Yeah, we'll we'll show the bosses later. Don't worry. Ah, uh, no charge. <laughs> that goofy ass throw. He didn't have the scum gale throw yet. It's a it's a normal throw in this game. I didn't want to play Akuna because there's a there's a weird glitch with her. Where if you if you do her throw and then press a button, the throw does whatever whatever damage the button would have done. Which is usually, like, way less. But... Wow, I didn't grab there. If you can do super right before the throw... Throw hits the ground. <laughs> they take a lot of damage. I'll try to show that off better later. Let's try it now. So if you can you can fuck yourself over if you just start mashing jab after a throw. Like this. Because then it only does a jab's worth of damage. So don't do that. But if you have a supercharge, you can just do it after the throw for more damage. Which Shin is not gonna let me do. I missed! It's a weird motion. There we go. Because the motion is back, half circle back to up back, B and C. She had that glitch in 94 too. I forgot to show it, I think. Andy's got something like that too. 
The thing is, without power at max, it doesn't really, like, do that much more. Wow! Bait my throw attempt with Psycho Sword. That's a new move she got. Uh, Afro Amish, thank you for the 47 months. Oh yeah, she's got a reflector. So Kensu's got a really insane overhead. Unfortunately, it's not going to work on the computer because they're going to block it every time, but that move, that move is an overhead. Look how fast that is. They gave him a new standing heavy kick to, like, compensate for that. Is that Belmont? Yeah, that's a command. It's uh, towards and heavy kick. The ultimate thing for the 100 bits. That move is safe on max. Yup. Wake up, super! Damn, what an answer. He's good! Uh, that's her damage. Maybe this team was not a good choice. <laughs> I want to land that dizzy combo so bad. No, not a cross up. I have to like not cross up. Oh, that was it. Wait, doesn't he have the the run grab? Did I do the motion wrong? Every time I'm, I'm like waiting to try to do like a guard cancel, the computer just walks up and throws me. No good. Oh god, that move is unsafe. Okay, I just mash crouching light kick and it worked. Real tough. Yeah, I think Team Akari is still pretty strong in this. Hydran's still really good. He doesn't have the the infinite glitch anymore, but he's still he's still strong. <laughs> Fireball's got a big hitbox. Takuma's uh, dodge attack is pretty shitty, unfortunately. Okay, Raw Super just never fucking works with Takuma. Yeah, fucking <laughs> 2001. God. Oh god! Isn't that ain't taunted? What a. Shit. Oh my god, Peter's... Peter's having a normal one. Oh, Phoenix Arrow's with punch? It's not with kick, okay. I was trying to do it with kick. I forgot. Oh, nice. Low crush. Computer will never let me get normal grabs. Yeah, Atina's voice in this game is pretty, uh, pretty shrill. <laughs> I'm just gonna do this. Standing heavy kick all day. When in doubt, standing heavy kick kind of kind of fucks up the CPU. Oh yeah, Clark has uh, has run grab in this game. 
Gatling attack. Ah! That's so hard to react to. I said he had it, and then he did it. Oh god, what a trade. Man, I don't want to resort to, like, boss characters already. <laughs> Alright, Iori, Terry, Chin. Iori's insanely good in this. His first game, and he's really strong. No, no. Shit. I can't. Okay. Can't even land a combo. So you never want to do the third part of the Rekka. You can actually juggle with DP instead and it does more damage. And he has a bufferable crouching light kick, which he doesn't have in very many games. I took that away in 96. Hey, stop that. Oops. It's gotta be the light record, not the heavy. Too far! Oh yeah, the motion's like different, isn't it? I don't think you can alternate guard. Am I dead? Of course I'm dead. He was maxed. Teddy! Okay, the other good AI strat with Terry is... Not to get grabbed. But to do... To do crack shit. If I ever get... If I ever get the chance to do it! Never got the chance to do it. Ah, damage. Okay. Oh, that crushing heavy punch is so shit. Yeah, I get that shit, baby. Chin's Fire Super does a shitload of chip damage. Go back to the gym, tadpole. Oh, the R was Rugal. Who would have thought? Wink. I know you can't wait. Who could that be? Alright, let's try that again. Hey, it's uh, the Scream layout. Oh my god, the computer's on another level today. Um, okay, that didn't work. He comboed into super, he didn't even do it raw, he just comboed into it. Jesus Christ. Stop that. Christ. That's what I did. Oh, God. Alright, Chen, it's up to you. Yeah, hold this chip. Yeah, drunk walk. Yeah, too bad all those Neo Geo lands closed down. Can 
I just like actually jump see him? Yes, I can. Kind of. Oh god. Max Goro is always scary, no matter what, what game it is. Right, I guess I can just do this. I guess I can just do that. Yeah, when the bar is max, you do more damage with everything. All your normals do more damage, your special moves do more damage. There's more knockback on special moves, so that it makes some moves safe. And if you do a desperation when your bar is... Uh, when the power bar is full and you're red, it does a little more damage. Wow. Come on! Fuck! Fuck! I'm too scared to do anything, it just counters everything. Alright, maybe we can just play Japan team. Mirror match. It's at the point where I gotta start abusing shit. Oh god. Dodge attack on dodge attack? Wait, does he... He's got a different jump back D than forward D? I didn't even realize that. That's weird. That's some fair damage, I think. Shit, I've already forgotten what the trick was to the infinite. <laughs> Damn, that's pretty safe on Max. Not entirely safe, but pretty safe. Many Mario combos. What an answer. <laughs> Just mash crouching light. No profile that shit. Pansy. I'm just now getting into the art of fighting stage, which has the uh, has the weird gimmick of locking the screen for like the first five seconds. While you wait for the elevator. Interesting, uh, interesting stage gimmick. Oops. Just keep doing that. Goro can't do his infinite anymore. Walk forward, charge move, huh? Wrong idiot. CP is just full on cheating everything. Yeah, there isn't a cheat box. Come on, get close, idiot. Yeah! Oh, that's not super. I thought that was super. Two half circles back plus C. It's kind of uh, input reader's a little fussy in this game. Nice 
Oh, okay. Sure. Hmm. Eh, a little shit. Oh my god. It's free in every single input. There we go. Yeah, everybody's got to get back on the elevator for every round. Well, this game doesn't have dashes, so Goro can't do that yet. Double tapping towards makes you hop forward. Like, this game still does not have all the same... All the same gameplay engines that people know from, like, 98. That wouldn't change until the next game. Like, you still don't have hops. Oh, God. What the fuck? I keep doing this. I shot his feet so, so hard with fire, he started bleeding from the face. I'm not angry, just disappointed. Yeah, there's super jumps, but they're not great. What in blazes? Fart gas. Oh. Oh, gee, it's Rugal again. What a surprise. My. <laughs> Rugal's about to be racist. <laughs> well, still not as bad as what, what John Crawley said to, to Lee in Art of Fighting 2, I guess. I mean, he's not wrong. They're Asian. You're meat, pal. Daddy? Papa-san. Okay, Kyo, knock it off. Reincarnated. Feel the universe is full power. What? He's brainwashed. Google, you monster. So in 94, you had to you had to fight depowered Rugal and then powered up Rugal. In this game, you gotta fight Kyo's dad before you fight Rugal, and you gotta do it in the same fight. <laughs> the same team. And CPU Saishu cheats like crazy. The safest strat is just to do dodge attack into fireball, but look how little damage it did. Now the CPU is like taking less damage from stuff. Well, I made that look easy, but with any other character, he just he just counters the shit out of you. Papa San. Kill him, Kyo. Avenge me. Oh, I'm dead again. Sorry. Feed a dog barks loudest. Taste my fury. Uh oh, he's a zombie now. It's not just Rugal, he's Omega Rugal. Alright, so. Early jump CD sometimes works. Maybe I can do dodge attack. Oh no! Okay. And a side cutter, yep. Okay. This. I've kind of forgotten the timing. <laughs> I mean, I. 
There you can time it out. Oh, can I do it like that? No! Fuck! Uh, I couldn't even get the grab because Venomar is too jump. His jump is too floaty. Ow. Okay. What the f Damn it. I'm missing the jump CD inputs. It's kind of bad. <laughs> All right, fair enough. As usual, CPU Rugal is is a problem. We're just gonna do a. We'll do an edit team. We're not gonna get lore, but that's alright. Let's go back to top tier. So I've got a pretty good Rugal Strat with my. At least I think it's pretty good. Also, there's a there's a pretty funny typo if you beat the game with a, an edit team, so. I think it was this game. Where was the Twilight Ride? Okay. Banow, banow, banow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, the whole earth. Fuck. Fireball has a big hitbox. There's something on the ground. There we go. Give us a block. Oh yeah, there was another another strat that sometimes works. Not like that. He has I think he's gotta be in the corner. Okay, so the, the my strat is get in the corner. I'm gonna, I'm gonna elbow him to death. Which he's not getting hit by. Oh god! Okay. Elbow to the nuts saves the day. But because it was an edit team, they they put generic endings in if you get a if you edit your team. But I'll be back, you jerks! Rugal beefeated. King of Fighters 95 ends. He's been defeated. At least until 1996 when... To be continued? <laughs> so you do get the, the staff roll on a, on a continue at least. But there is like a... Uh, I guess it's the CD version where you get a you get a special Team Psycho Soldier song. Probably only on the CD version. Yeah, this jam is way too chill. Wow! 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 It's 
a dangerous bomb. Bruce T. Rolly Yamamoto. Fuku Fuku. Navy Melon. <laughs> All right, so we got to show some of the some of the funny stuff you can do in this game. I'm dead ink. Thank you for the quarter. I keep uh. Yeah, don't worry. Don't worry, Adam. I'm gonna show it. I wanted to do, what was the, uh... I guess I'll just make new save states. I need to remember the time on that kill combo. Cause this is pissing me off. Alright, get him in the corner. Buttons have I not used yet? Wasn't that the trick? It was like, uh. Okay, I think I remember now. You have to do like fireball with heavy kick, heavy kick, and then you have to do fireball, light kick, fireball, heavy kick, fireball, light kick, fireball, heavy kick. Something like that. And you get 100% damage off one chuckle. That's what makes Kyo one of the best characters in the game. Can't do it too high or they, they drop out. Yeah. Pretty good. And you can start it off a dodge attack. Somehow missed it. Resets. Uh. Oh yeah, so like Hydern lost the uh, the infinite, right? But he still has the uh, the glitch, the other glitch where if you do a, I was trying to do this against against a computer, but they didn't want to behave. Where if you uh, if you whiff a uh, moon slasher, you get more damage off his off that command throw. Which you know gives you uh, gives you health back. Yo, Al Anonymous, thank you for the raid. But if you whip the moon slasher and then do it, that happens. Still at max. Oops. <laughs> Yes, that's some fair damage. Off one command throw. That's like, what, 70%? That's pretty good. Yeah, that doesn't dizzy anymore, huh? And of course, the... Uh, The one everybody loves. So, the stage in this game is determined by... I think which character you pick first on the character select screen. So if you pick Terry, you get Terry's background. So let's say you, you have Terry, and then you pick... Uh, you pick Chin and Kim. And then you decide, I'm gonna put Chin first. On the Fatal Fury team stage. Safe state's taken moments before disaster. Because Chin has a floaty jump. He does not land from the uh, from the dock fast enough, so you can uh, you can see that he's still in the air when Iori's on the ground. Shit, I don't remember the timing. 
Gotta do it fast, I think. You can actually get three reps of that, but I don't remember the timing. Wow, that's a lot of joy. Shit. I'm gonna turn off the background music, that's gonna get to me. There we go! 75% damage because you decided to play Chin first on the on the Fatal Fury stage. But that's your own fault if you decide to if you decide to to play Chin first when you're the one picking the stage. You got yourself into this mess. Man, it's hard to get three reps though. <laughs> there we go. Completely fair. Um, Yori also has some other funny shit. Like if you do his, uh... wait no, not that throw. This throw. And then you do that. You're like right in his face on on get up, right? And then if you walk forward, go into dodge as he's getting up. I did that too early. I think that was a cross-up. Yeah, he has to block the other way. So there's there's tons of like funny ass setups in this game. Like if you ever if you ever watch like high level play of this, there's like there's tons of funny grime like this. There's like there's dead body cross ups. Like uh like there there was that one homo genius where like they got stuck in the corner and they were just like doing crouching light kicks at nothing. Like there's there's a lot of a lot of shit like that in this game. Like I can probably do this. Nah, I can get over. Kyo can also do something like that with uh, with his dodge attack, because it has a lot of range, I think. Except I gotta get a knockdown. Something like this? Yep, I'm not sure if that was a cross-up. Oh, he doesn't have a uh, kick throw. <laughs> yeah, which way do you block that? I'm gonna hold left. Yeah, you gotta you gotta hold left to block that. That's a cross up. And then he winds up on the other side. So there's just there's just tons of funny shit like that. And then of course. I didn't want to use the bosses, but if you want to play the bosses, you hold down the start button. Up the left C, right A, down B. Up the left C, right A, down B. Isn't that the code? Up the left C, right A, down B. Am I not holding start? I am. Do I have the wrong code? <laughs> Up the left C, right A, down B. Hard code to get. Why is this not working? Uh, I don't have the wrong code, do I? Up B, right C, left A, down B. I somehow forgot. Okay. Not left C. There they are. There are the boys. Yeah, for some reason, bosses are tournament legal. It's just like, yeah, fuck it, you're playing KF95, you know what you're getting yourself into.
where you've got uh, you've got shit like this standing light kick. Which you can bully the hell out of the computer with. Genocide Cutter is... It's not a DP. It's down, down, back, back, up, back, plus kick. Actually, yeah, let me play the computer with this shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, we got edit teams for the computer. That happens sometimes. So the computer in particular does not know how to deal with standing light kick. For the most part. I guess Hydran has an answer. He's got a good light kick. So that's some of the best anti-CPU tech right there. Except Choi can kind of low profile it. Push back on dodge press. Well, I have they have to block god press for that to work, unfortunately. <laughs> but Saishu is not anywhere near as near as busted as Rugal, unfortunately, or fortunately. Let's see, uh, that move. That's an overhead. Is that an overhead? Why not? Oh, for sure. Saishu's definitely worse than Kill. He doesn't have an infinite. <laughs> he doesn't have an infinite combo. Oh, yeah, the other thing I, I forgot to show off. Here, kill me. Shang! Shang, would you kill me, please? Chang! Chang broke. Alright, this one I haven't seen before. I don't think I've seen this before. So I forgot to talk about this in 94. Need to do Chin Super again. Blast some damage, that's just stage one. So that, uh, that flame animation... Looks a little bit like Last Resort, doesn't it? One of the uh, one of the graphic guys who worked on Last Resort also worked on KOF ninety four and ninety five, so they kind of they kind of recycled an animation in there. <laughs> That's uh, I think it's pretty funny. I I never made that connection until somebody else pointed it out. And I love Last Resort. Oh yeah, we gotta show the chip on that bad boy, huh? Oops. I didn't pick... Okay, whatever. Bum-bum! Alright, get him down to low health. Okay, now I have to... Oh, this is hard to do with 
two hands. Um, I'm gonna map map player two right to a button on my joystick. All right, hold this chip. Each super does about like 32% chip damage, 33. And it's pretty safe on block. Not entirely safe, but it's pretty safe. So I feel like Chin's kind of underrated in this game. Let's get, yeah, let's get Max. With Max, it's like half damage. If they don't block, it's... It's a little bit more. A little bit. Uh, yeah, the four hit jump C, jump C. Yeah. You can't do anything else off that. It just looks funny. All right. We need, yeah, we need to look at the CD version very briefly. We're gonna we're gonna go over on time, even with only three games. <laughs> So you have to remember that, like, they were pushing the Neo CD as being, like, you know, you can you can play the the arcade games at home for, like, 6,000 yen or whatever. But this is around the time that, you know, fighting games are becoming big. And with fighting games, you have to... You gotta wait through load times. Uh, for KOF, that's even worse. That's an even worse idea. Uh, would you start, please? And don't you dare tell me... Don't you dare give me a piracy screen. Why doesn't this want to start? There we go. So we got to do the initial load. And this is on the double speed drive. You'd have to wait just you'd have to wait twice as long on a single speed drive. This is just to load the title screen. Oh, but look at that Neo Geo ball roll. Amazing. Alright, I wanna hear the uh the intro. Music's off sync. <laughs> that owl sample is actually in another game, by the way. I bet nobody can guess which game it is. God, all the music's delayed by like two seconds, unfortunately. Okay. So let's say you want to play some uh, some three on three. Oh yeah, we got some arranged music. Wait, team edit? Yes. Shit, do I have my start button mapped? I want uh, I want Rugal. I want the Rugs. Actually, wait, are my buttons set right? Yeah, they are. Oh, come on. Are my buttons actually set right? This is B. If I don't get it right, I have to wait through loading again. All right, women's team it is.
a <laughs> confused king face. Well, that's not too bad, because there's only, like, one, one track to... one character to load. All right. This is some jazzy ass music. Well, I beat one character. Time to load another. This is way worse on a single speed drive. On a double speed, it's maybe okay. But also, they, uh, the CD has, like, two tracks for every stage. So it starts at, like, a different part of the of the song on round two. And then on round three, it goes back to the, to the first part. The sax. And then it's our server with the first stage. Alright. She's dizzy. So yeah, they, they tried, but. It's not too bad in this game, but it's going to get much, much worse with other Neo CD games. Beefcake? That was a mirror match. Okay, I need I need to hear the good, the good tune. I need to hear this just once. That's an interesting Terry face. Does Terry wear his hat backwards when he does a power dunk? Okay. Oh yeah, I forgot about the the fucked up thing Terry can do with with uh, with bird knuckle on this game. I can't do that on keyboard though. Okay, I'm gonna have to reset this. Hi, Andy. Okay, how do I reset again? Okay, single play, why not? to that stage. So Terry's got a, a weird thing he can do with Burn Knuckle in this game that... I think he can, it's, it's only in this game. It's not in any other KOF. I gotta show this off. So usually when you do light Burn Knuckle, you know, it's a, it's a fast Burn Knuckle that doesn't go very far, right? Like that. The heavy one has more startup, goes farther, right? Makes sense. But okay, if you do if you do the motion for the light one and then do a forward fireball with a different button, it changes the properties of the move. So if you do backwards fireball with C for the heavy one, or backwards fireball with A for the light one, you get the light version startup, and then fireball with heavy punch, he gets the hard version's distance. Like that. Like you gotta be really fast on it. And then you can do it the other way, too, like backwards fireball C, forward A. And then he doesn't go as far. 
I don't know why you would do that one. But you can get like more distance out of it with that. There's some other moves that have uh, have things like that, like. Uh, I don't know if it'd be faster just reset. <laughs> like Rio's got some some weird thing you can do with the super. Oh, I can't do save states because Neo CD crashes. You have guts, kid. Oh shit! I tried to start. Oh, it didn't give me time to like load up. Man, you gotta be fast on hit and start. So Ryo's got a weird thing he can do with his, his super move in this game. If you mash Fireball with A, like during the last the last part of it, he does a light uppercut instead of a heavy uppercut and it does more damage. Like this is the normal one. And then if you do this, it actually does more damage. So there's some so there's some other moves I think that can be like changed like that. Uh, Safe states crash the Neo CD Z in Mame, yeah. Also, this game also introduced like the the weird like semi throws. Like this is like kind of a command throw. You get a juggle off of. Oops. I was trying to combo into it. And if you try to like buffer into it out of range, it just like cuts off the normal move entirely. Oh yeah, the other thing I wanted to like mention about this game. I mentioned earlier that like, you know, they they brought in like all the pretty much all the old characters. Except for like the USA sports team. And so, like, a lot of the sprites are the same. That means, that, like, whenever there's, like, new moves in this game, they animated them, like, way better than everything else. Like, look how bad, like, the animation is on, like, Joe's Standing Heavy Punch or Light Kick. It's, like, they're, like, two or three frames. But then you do Standing Heavy Kick, and there's, like, it's, like, a few frames of that. There's, like, three, four, five, six. There's all... That, that that's like way more animated than all his other moves. And it's kind of like that with Hydern's like uh, like that wind pose where he like turns his back to the camera. Let me see if I can get a win with Hydern. Oh god, I... <laughs> Whoa, that was... That was cursed. That was really cursed. Let me just see if I can get a win with Hydern, so you can see like how many how many fucking frames of animation they put on this. Speed it up. Teddy, Teddy, go! Good lord, the damage. Not that one. The other pose. Of course, now the, the CPU isn't going to do it. I like how Andy's like falling backwards during that throw. He's not standing on the ground. Damn it, Hydern, come on! Help me out here. Alright, I'm going back to regular MAME because I I can't load save states in with the CD. Game is not cooperating. Hi there, Basta, Eoli, 
I just want to show a really well animated wind pose. Can you help me out here, SNK? Should be good, right? Damn it, come on! He's not gonna do the other one, is he? There we go. There were so many frames of animation with him just like lowering his arm, it's fucking insane. I just found that, like, really, really impressive. So anything that was new to the game, they... It gave the, uh, the artist, like, just, you know, the excuse to just go ham. Because, yeah, all, all, all like, the, the rest of his normal moves look really... really choppy in comparison. But, uh, yeah, KOF 95, it's, it's quite the game. It's a definite, uh, definite step up from 94, despite the, uh, the high damage. Here, is this a track everybody was talking about? Or was it the other one? Okay, so we gotta we gotta rank this. That part actually gets cut off in the Neo CD version. It just it just starts with the screen, by the way. It's only on, it's only on the full range. All right, so is this it? Is this the new number one? Have we finally toppled Fatal Fury Special? One sixteen, one one two. 1-1. One, 1-2-1-1. One. One, one, one. 95 one. <laughs> Eight, two. I would definitely feel inclined to... <laughs> to maybe bump Fatal Fury Special out. But I don't... Not everybody's in agreement there. I don't know. Um... I'm definitely not going to... Just abuse my authority and make it number one. So let's... Let's put this to a poll. make this... If it's not number one, then we'll figure out where to go from there. So please, please vote honestly. There is a poll in chat now. Please, please vote. Probably like a few hundred people on stream. Please vote. <laughs> Maybe it's needed a BBH minute. The old small thing for the, for the one herb bits. Oh, it's... Kinda close. Sorta close. I think the... I think the yeses have it. I mean, the game certainly has flaws. It's not going to stay at number one forever. I can I can see it getting knocked out by by some other stuff coming soon. Bong. But for now, it gets to a 
enjoy its time at the top. It's not getting knocked out by 96, I can tell you that much. <laughs> 98 though, yeah, maybe. Get these off my screen. Yeah, we're 